Hi dears, today we learn about a new chapter, Reproduction in Animals. Okay, Reproduction in Animals. You already learn about this reproduction term in your 7th standard, isn't it? You learn plant reproduction, yes? So what's the importance of reproduction? Hmm? We know each and every day all living organisms, they respire or they breathe, they digest or they excrete their waste materials from their body. Yes, in the same way they reproduce for continuing the or continuation of a species. So reproduction is essential for a continuation of a species. For example, in our surroundings, different animals are there. Yes, they reproduce, they, they continue or they maintain their next generation through this reproduction process. So this is very important. Okay, hmm? so let's move to reproduction chapter. Today we learn about mode of reproduction. Okay, mode of reproduction. You learn in your 7th standard or previous class what? Yes, plants reproduce two modes or two ways. What are they? Sexual reproduction and asexual reproduction. Okay. In the same way, animals also reproduce through sexual reproduction and asexual reproduction. Okay. So today we discuss about the first one, sexual reproduction. Okay. Sexual reproduction. Later class we discuss asexual reproduction. So let's move to sexual reproduction. Sexual reproduction you learn in your 7th standard. Uh, especially in plant. In the case of plants. Huh? You learn the plants have what? Reproductive organ. Male and female reproductive organ. It's called antrecium and gynecium. In the same way, animals have what? Yes, male and female reproductive part. And they produce gametes. Okay, they produce gametes. And the fusion of this gamete, zygote will be formed. Or the, after the fusion of gamete, first stage, zygote will be formed. The zygote multiply and form a new individual. Okay. Hmm? So this fusion of male and female gamete. Okay. Is called sexual reproduction. So sexual reproduction which means the fusion of male and female gamete. It's called sexual reproduction. So first... We learn about the sex organs or the reproductive parts of animals. Okay, first we move to male reproductive part. Okay, this is male reproductive part. Okay, this is male reproductive part. So this male reproductive part consists of main three or, or main three parts. Okay, this organ consists of main three parts. What are they? Let's learn. Two pairs of testes. First one is two pairs of testes. And sperm duct. Okay. Sperm duct. Hmm? And a long penis. These are the three parts. First one, two pairs of testes and sperm duct and penis. These are the three main parts. The testes produce male gamete called sperms. Okay. The testes produce male gametes called sperms. Okay. Sperms. That's very important. Sperms. Okay. So this testes can produce millions of sperms. Okay. So millions of sperms produced by testes. So this testes produce male gametes called sperms. Look at this picture. Huh? This is sperm. This is a sperm. So sperm is a single cell. Okay. 
So we can observe the sperm with the help of microscope. Okay. So sperm is a single cell. It consists of three parts. First one head region and the middle region. The second one is middle region and a tail portion. Tail portion which helps to move. Okay, the movement with the help of this tail portion. Okay, hmm. so the sperm consists of mainly three parts, a head portion, middle piece and a tail. Okay, and the single cell sperm consists of all the cell components. You know what are the cell components? Hmm. Do you know that? So we will learn in our ninth standard what are the components of cell. Okay, so these are the basic information about a male reproductive part. Students, today we discuss about reproduction, importance of reproduction, sexual reproduction, mode of reproduction. Two types are the sexual reproduction and the sexual reproduction. And we learn. Today we learn what sexual reproduction. In this sexual reproduction we know male and female reproductive part is there. So first we learned what? Yes, male reproductive organ. Hmm? And we learn three parts, testis, sperm duct and penis. And we learn sperm also, minute structure called sperm, it is the male gamete. Okay. The fusion of male and female gamete is called sexual reproduction. Okay. So, please study well. Have a nice day.